So I feel like we're on the set of a Jane Austen novel today. I know, it's spectacular, isn't it? Rockwell Hall featuring its own ballroom and Italian fountain. I don't think I've ever said that about any property ever before. No, and the setting that it's in is just stunning. We're moments away from town, but sitting on 7.1 hectares of land. It's so private and so serene. But more than that, it's the stories. And boy, does this home have some stories. Thomas Hungerford, who built the house back in 1881, had a reputation as an entertainer which is no doubt why he built that rather ostentatious ballroom on the end after finishing the original house. And that trend continues with the next owner, William Dawson, who is an original brewer for Spates, hosting the annual garden parties right here in this very spot. And with the current owners, over their period of 30 years of ownership, have been known for throwing fantastic parties, weddings, birthday parties, garden parties, you name it. Absolutely, it's the kind of place you want to share and it's the kind of place you wouldn't want to leave. You know, there's only been three owners in the last 100 years, which is phenomenal. You step inside to a very spacious home, yet the character and charm give it a comfortable coziness. One cool thing about this property is that the period features are still very much intact and give the house a really strong feeling of history. This room is a great example of just some of the work the current owners have done within the home and gives you an idea of how the home will look when brought back to its former glory. So we're standing in Thomas Hungerford's ballroom, the entertainer from the 1880s. I know, imagine if these walls could talk, the stories they would tell over the last 140 odd years. But you know, you can use this room however you want. It could be a pool room, music room, or just dry garlic. Why not? And with it set on 7.1 hectares of land, there is a little bit of subdivision potential. However, there's so much more to it than that. There's the paddocks, the orchard, the barn, pine plantation, there's a native bush gully, like it is simply mind boggling. It is, and you know, for the right people, this is an incredible project to take on. I mean, imagine bringing up your kids here. It's a pretty spectacular spot. Take the house, you bring it back to its former glory, and he has something that is breathtaking and absolutely one of a kind. Hey, have we got any parties coming up? Uh, your 50th, that'd be pretty soon, wouldn't it? Uh, too soon. <laughs> Just organising in advance. It'd grow closer, it though. It would. Love it. 